Hello friends, how are you doing? You're welcome to the channel. Let's solve this together. How are we going to solve a question like this? 2 log 2x plus log 2y equal to 8 and log 2x minus log 2y equal to 1. How are we going to solve it together? It's very simple. Let's solve it together. Yeah, the first thing I'm going to say, as you can see, we have log 2x here up here, likewise down. We also have log 2y up, likewise down. So the next thing I'm going to say, just say, let's log 2x, let's first one, equal to p, I'm using p, and let's log 2y equal to q. I want to represent this. So instead of writing all this log 2x and log 2y, the next thing we are going to now write is, so instead of log 2x, it's now be 2 because we have 2 already here, 2 log 2x, that is log 2x is now p, plus the next one, log 2y, log 2y is q, equal to 8, equation 1. The second one, log 2x, like we said, is p, we have minus log 2y is q, equal to 1, equation 2. Then the next thing we are now going to do, because it's now a simultaneous question, next thing we are going to do is we are going to add the two together so that we can eliminate our Q. That is, we add equation 1 and equation 2. You add it together. What does it mean? 2P plus P, that is 3P. P plus minus Q, that's 0. Equal to 8 plus 1, that is 9. Divide both sides by 3 by 3. Therefore, our P equal to 3. Very good, we have got now p. It means our q. So substitute your q in either equation 1 or 2. I want to use equation 1. So that is 2p plus q equal to 8. And our p is 3. That is 2 times, instead of p, which is 3, 2 times 3, that's 6 plus q equal to 8. Therefore, q equal to 8 minus 6, which is 2. Very good. We have gotten our p and q, but we are not true because our question is in form of x and y. So let's now return it back from here. So far we said log 2x, we said equal to p. And what's our p that we have gotten here? Our p here is 3. Therefore, our x is now going to be your base here, you bring it here. And this 3 will be return to power. It's 2. So it's now going to be 2 raised to the power of 3, which is going to be 8. That's our x. It means our y. We also said log 2y equals, according to here, to this, we said equal to q. And our q here is 2. Therefore, your y equal to, bring your 2 here, 2. This will be the power to go up. This power of 2, which is going to be 4. Therefore, your x equal to 8 and y equal to 4. It's as simple as that. You just use a letter to represent your log here. Log here, substitute it back. It's leading to simultaneous equation. The moment you're true to simultaneous equation, you return it back to where you started from and you get your x and y. It's as simple as that. Thank you very much for watching. Please do take care of yourself and please subscribe to the channel. Bye-bye.